Hey, good morning everybody, Ty Garner here, and I um, just want to share with you a little bit this morning out of my L3 in Psalms today, and uh, pretty simple truth this morning, and I know you probably have heard something similar to this, um, but it's in Psalm 66, uh, verses 10 and then 12, it says, For you have tried me, O God, you have refined us as silver is refined. We went through fire and through water, yet you brought us into a place of abundance. You know, it, it's very difficult when you're going through different trials, um, whether it be with uh, your family, your marriage, your kids, your business, um, you know, or spiritual trials. It's, it's not an easy thing to go through, but, you know, if we stand on his word and know that, you know, just like it says here in Psalm, the things that he takes us through, they're, they're there to refine us. Um, there's another uh, scripture in, in the Bible that talks about where the Lord says he will never put on you more than you can handle. So, you know, really you should count it joy if you're going through these various trials. Um, as Paul said, you know, the more things that you're, you know, put through, it really just shows that God has, you know, ultimate faith and trust in you to, you know, to that you can take it, that you can handle it. You know, I, my wife has often said, you know, I just, you know, don't know how, you know, you could deal with this, you know, whether it be, hey, like my mom died of cancer and, you know, that was a very difficult thing, but ultimately I know and can look back now that God used that to grow my faith, uh, my faith in Him. You know, strangely enough, um, you know, when we went through the financial times, um, you know, God used that to, to teach me uh, about finances and how to better deal with finances. You know, I've still got a long life to live, right? And so, you know, I learned that at an early age, um, you know, or anything you deal with your kids. You know, it's those things that God uses to refine you, to make you better. Um, and He just knows, you know, like I said, if He's putting you through trials, really, I look at it and say, like, Thank you, God. You know, thank Him for the trials because you know that ultimately the end of that, like that verse says, is a place of abundance. He's He's going to give you uh, and do for you the the promises of the Bible, and that's to, to ultimately bring you to a place of abundance. So if you're pursuing Him um, and you go through trials, I mean, look at that trial and instead of you know wallowing in your own pity, you know, look at it and say, okay, God, what is this that you that you want me to get out of this? You know, so whatever trial you're facing today, you know, ask God, say, God, all right, you know, look, you know, I'm going through this financial time, I'm going through this thing in my marriage, you know, I'm dealing with this thing with my kids. You know, look at it in the face and say, God, what do you want me to get out of this? What are you trying to teach me and refine me so that I can be better and so that ultimately we can help other people to go through and deal with the same things that, you know, that we're going through. So, um, you know, a simple truth there, but really powerful. And hope that that uh, challenges you today to, to be better. And um, we'll talk to you soon. Have a great day.